So what would be the final temperature after mixing 200 grams of water at 50 degrees with 400 grams of water at 30 degrees Celsius? This sounds an awful lot like our average atomic mass that we calculated back from chapter one, two, and three. Well, how do we calculate that, right? Well, we had our part, which was like our percentage times our mass, and then plus a second part, which was our second percentage times another mass, and we just divided by the whole, which is like 100%, right? Or something like that, the whole. So this is our whole, right? Well, this is a very similar situation. If we want our temperature, which is an average temperature because these mix together, we have our first part, which is 200 grams, right? Times our temperature, which is 50 degrees, plus we have our second mass, which is 400 grams, times our second temperature, which is 30 degrees, and that's all over the whole, and our whole is 600 grams worth of water. And if we figure that out, we get 36.67 degrees Celsius. So this is our average temperature. Well, guess what? When we mix water together at different temperatures, they're going to come up to an average temperature. So the way we calculate this is very similar to how we calculate our average atomic mass for an atom with different isotopes.